hasn't sunk yet. You need me to hold your boat? All right. <laughs> It'll be okay. Whee! You're on your own now. <laughs> Don't leave me, Brad. All right, thanks again. Yep. So we're just gonna keep going straight for a bit. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> I had to make sure I uh, cut through the waves, else I'm gonna tip. <laughs> yeah, at least it's nice weather, not like. Uh... I may have brought too much stuff for two days. <laughs> ah, that's okay. I just want to be super prepared. Oh yeah. I also didn't pack as well as I could have. But... When you, when you pack boxes, they don't pack them as well as like cylindrical like bags and stuff. Yeah, I yeah. Just use garbage bags so my tent is uh, in this thing here with a bunch of other stuff. And then uh, the rest of the stuff, of course, in the back there, but. How big is the tent that you brought? Oh, uh, it's a three person tent. Nice. I think that's two people comfortable. Yeah, mine's, mine says three. It only fits me. One of my poles is broken and I didn't get any tape to fix it, but it looks like it's flattened out past that island now. Yeah. Yeah, this is the first time being uh, on the water with the kayak. The last time I was here was uh, with Brad in the ice shack. Okay. So, I knew where the islands and stuff were from the time that we, uh, got to the, where his ice shack was, but I don't know where it starts going shallow or anything like that. It's nice when people like pencil themselves in on, on what island they were on. And yeah. For how many days they were staying or something. Yeah, exactly. Like this is a really nice spot to, uh, to go and it's because they have campsites all around, it just makes things a little bit easier to, to just uh, get into camping. Yeah, hopefully. <laughs> I don't know if the, the, the power boats go down further because they can travel further away. Yeah, it's hard to say. Yeah. Yeah, I figured if we uh, go as much as we can, try and reach uh, roughly that uh, one spot he was suggesting, anyways. Not yeah. not the furthest furthest island, but. Closer to where his ice shack was, there's uh, two camping spots there. I think it's number 14 is the good one. 15 he doesn't know much about. So if there's no one on 14 or whatever, then that's where we can try and get to maybe. Could have tried to find a spot to set up, but I, I, I don't know if I'd know what I was doing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I probably would have done the same same thing. Look for a spot and. Aim for it. My, my brother's, my brother's like, do you ever like have anxiety or worry about those sort of things? I'm like, maybe like if I think about it afterwards, but it's kind of in, in my subconscious. Yeah. Afterwards, maybe it's, maybe anxiety for some people we just kind of suppress it, like we do our emotions. Yeah, maybe. Oop. We pretend we're not afraid. We pretend we're not worried. Because. Really, anxiety is like worried about something that you don't have control of. Though. So, like, why exactly, yeah. Of yeah. I mean, part of your body always is, right? Sometimes your body gets excited about things that you need to get excited about. Oh yeah. It's just like the, it's the genetic response. That's yeah. There, the stressful situation driving can make your heart rate go up. Yeah. I, I think that's why I pick islands for now until I get used to the camping. Because <laughs> then I know at least on islands, there's no like, there shouldn't be any big uh, big animals per se, but. But the island I was on though, had uh, moose droppings, uh, lots of it actually. Um, I didn't see bear scat or anything that I, that I recall. There might've been one, but it could have also been a, 
coyote or something too. Oh, we're gonna have some waves, I think. Is there a boat coming? Uh, probably eventually, yeah. They'll go around us or whatever, though. I have to be careful how far, how much I'm pulling on this because I, I don't want to lean too much. I don't think. Yeah. I have a, a bit of limitation. Yeah, yeah. You don't have to rush or anything. Just take your time. Oh no, I'm good. I, I <laughs> just, my mic not be balanced. Good left, weight wise, left, left to right, maybe. I don't know. I'll just uh, follow along uh, behind you there and see uh, what it looks like. See if I'm pulling to the right. Yeah, it might be. Well, it's hard to tell now because of the waves, but. Oh. There we go. <laughs> I had to cut through the wave there. I was going to flip. So pulling to the right, you mean at the back there? Oh, nice. We're getting some winds on our backs. A bit of kayak in, in the last month has been so hot. Yeah. But I was doing a lot, like in the spring and yeah. I think it was one week there, one week where I did like 90k. 90k? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> yeah, I haven't gone that far. <laughs> I, might, I don't know, it might have been a two week period maybe. I don't know. Well, that's still a good amount of water though. That's kind of what I was thinking too. Although it looks like it's a camping, uh, oh, it looks like a camping symbol though. Yeah, I think that's a camping sy symbol. I was hoping it would give a number though. Camping. No camping? Like yellow maybe. Yeah. <laughs> or have it crossed out or something. Or is it crossed out? It's got like the no smoking. Oh, okay. Yeah. I'm glad it calmed down though. When the wind was going against us, I was like, oh boy. <laughs> Am I keeping up with you well enough? Oh yeah. I got a longer paddle to reach over the side. Well, I wanted to try it. I got it from my kayak a while back to try like a, a lighter paddle. Yeah and see if I need it more length. I, I, I don't really need to eat it as long ordinarily, but it can be beneficial. Oh, definitely for a canoe though. With, with, with recreational packs, they tend to be a little wider for stability. Yeah. Even that model looks like it's a, a, a day four. Yeah. Who, who makes that one? Uh, the the canoe you mean, or the, or the kayak? Yeah. Is it, is it uh, or or? There's a sticker somewhere around here. Oh, I see something on the front, but I can't see the name. Uh, it's W I something something something. Wiser maybe. Oh, okay. Did you pick that up new or used? Uh, new. So there was a place. Just watch it. It's uh, a stump there. Um, there's a place just uh, south of Belleville, just over the big bridge there. Okay. Uh, oh, I forget the 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 name. I have the sticker somewhere on here. I think oh, still. I, want, I wonder if it's. Uh... A boat that's made by uh, like in Prince Edward County. Yeah, in around that area. Oh, so maybe maybe it's. Uh, they moved uh, since then, I think now, but oh, did they? it's like kayak, something like kayak RS type of thing, or. Oh, okay. Right. Yeah, I've had the I've had the kayak for about probably pretty close to ten years now. I think was. Oh wow. Uh, maybe even nine actually, and. Uh, I think it was Survivor Man type stuff that got me wanting to do more okay, yeah. back then. I'm just gonna go to your right there if uh, oh, 
Well, there's an uh, kind of like a, uh, a small you island. Want to check it out. Get it in your frame. No, I just didn't want to hit it. <laughs> oh. oh, I thought you wanted to go towards this nice island here and put it and film it. Oh yeah, it'll film some of that. I just didn't want to get too close to the to it though, just in case I hit, I hit uh, bottom or something. So I guess there's that island there. Right? Oh, the one right over here. Is there anybody on that one? Can you see a tent in there? I suppose when you're staying longer, you don't want to stay too far away or else, like long boat hauls, you get resupplied. Exactly. Yeah. So I mean, what we're doing though, it's not too bad. What those people had to do though, that'd be uh, a trip and a half, I think. <laughs> yeah, so I'm not sure if I see anyone over there. I guess, I guess that one's not a shelter, this one, but I don't even know if it's a campsite or not. Scraped up against something there. Still good, still good. Did you bring toilet paper? Uh, actually, that's one thing I forgot. Uh oh. <laughs> did you remember toilet paper? I hope I did. <laughs> I remember putting it in a Ziploc bag. I just don't remember. Well, I'll probably, if not, I'll have to do like the dip, dip in the water. Pretty right much. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's funny. Oh, I, I can fill this up with water. And then. <laughs> All right, Jay, bend over. <laughs> We've got, we've got a manual bidet. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh boy. Every problem solvable. Yeah, exactly. Now the one thing I remember not bringing is, that I, and I meant to get it when I was at the store the other day, is uh, like if we catch any fish in the boat, uh, the the line. Oh, the chains there. With the yeah, the chains. Yeah. I do have uh, yellow string though, so if we do catch any monsters or whatever it is. Yeah, we can do that. Just to make sure. I guess there's probably multiple sites on it, maybe? Yeah, so some of them have uh, more than one site on it. So the one that's. Uh, that's about 700 meters. I think that one had two spots on it. A chair with a bucket? <laughs> I think it might be. <laughs> there we go, we got our toilet. Oh, there's a tent there on the end. Oh, okay, so someone's already here. <laughs> So I see a sign there, so I'm not sure what that means. Might be the same thing, but on the other side there, I know there's a spot there. 
Uh, there might be a fire there on the island, actually. We can try the other side, though, because there's another another spot there. Yeah, there's there's people over there, but we can check over here just to see. Cause I think there's someone else at uh, that other spot too. Yeah, there's someone just tucked in, in behind here. Yeah. There might be people. I thought it was those same people over there though for the boat. Well, we'll see what this island looks like, and then maybe we'll just uh, swing around if it's if that island there is not a camp one there. Maybe. What I should have done is I should have taken a photo with, with my phone. Maybe someone's running a business where they're like chartering people out. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> charging the money for I heard on the radio today people charging uh, people to use their pools. Um, like one lady was charging uh, forty-five dollars U.S. an hour, that's little, that's and she get like five people. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> but U.S. though, it'd be like almost $70 or $60 Canadian or something. True. Yeah, I think I definitely overshot that though. Were you aiming for that one over there? Well, I thought this that was the direction, but I think it's kind of over in that area there. But I think that's where... I seen other people there too, so we'll just see what this looks like over here. Uh, I don't see anyone straight ahead here. I just wanted to see on the one side, though. Um, like if you go that way, you mean? You might be okay. Just uh, I see some stuff sticking out of the water there, closer to the shoreline there. Yeah, I think we're good here. So we just found the island that we're hoping to stay on. It's quite busy here. It's a beautiful conservation uh, spot. With, uh, they have campsites uh, designated. And then they also have some spots that you can't, uh, can't camp at. But uh, it's a decent sized lake. It's probably about almost six kilometers in, uh, in length. And uh, it ties into a few other different spots as well. It's almost seven o'clock, so the sun is definitely uh, going down. Just trying to find a, a decent spot for uh, Jordan, Jor uh, Jordan and I to uh, get off uh, the water. Oh, that's a nice little thing there. That's beautiful.
we, we finally made it. <laughs> I'm not sure where Jordan went to though. I have to go and find him. All right, so I think I'm not in a good little spot here. So I just have to try and make myself a path for now. Oh, oh this is when I'm wearing pants. Comes in handy though. Where I should have came from is over there though. This little spot would have been okay too. I'm trying to get in. Find Jordan. I don't know where he went to. Jordan? There you are. <laughs> Did you find any good spot for yourself there or no? There was one around here though. It had like a flat, uh, a flat type of rock. I think it might be this one right here. I parked my, my kayak just where you see it, but uh, I didn't realize it was all just brushed to get back in. Oh. So I'll have to eventually move mine, but. Where should I land, right here? Or? I was thinking even uh, if you come up uh, alongside here and then I'll try and hold on to the kayak. Oh, if you just start to unload a few things or something maybe? Yeah, that's what I was thinking. And then, uh, at least on the light or something. actually, yeah, you know what? Let's just uh, unload here because I was thinking the campsite could be over there. Yep. There's a there's a luxury toilet there. 